Okay, so with the new Windows 10 April update, it completely screwed over LAN connection. If you go to go to Network Internet Settings, uh, change Sharing Options. Basically, I went through all this and turned it on. So Private, turn on Network Discovery, File and Sharing, turn that on. Guest and Public, turn on, turn on, turn on. Password Protecting Sharing, turn off. Click save changes. Okay. The second thing you have to do, this is really important up here. The Ethernet has to say private network for a LAN connection or for this to work. The only way I have figured out how to change between these, because if you go to Ethernet and click on this, if you're not connected to the internet, they don't give you that option. So the only way you can change that is if you can somehow trick this connection. If you're connected to the internet while you're doing a LAN connection, this might still be an option, but I had to trick it by using tethering on my phone to give me an option of private or non-private. If you've done those things, here's the thing that I really want to talk about. If you go to network, and as you can see, it shows media devices, but it won't show the computer up here. I can't get that to work. So if you're wanting the icon to show this up here and you're specifically not going to settle on anything else, then just stop watching the video because I can't figure it out. But if you're willing to do a workaround in order to do file sharing through LAN connection, if you do uh, forward slash forward slash and then whatever the name of your PC is, so like, so for example, mine is Aaron dash PC dash and then you're going to type in user users hit that okay so you get to this point right here next go to view navigation panel expand to open folders boom right below network here shows uh, Aaron's PC so what you can do is you can go to pen to quick access and then underneath quick access Aaron's PC will be there now what good is a network if you don't have at least two computers? So, backslash, backslash, the name of my wife's computer, Shauna, here it is, Shauna PC user. You might have to type the whole thing out. Okay. Now that you don't, you shouldn't have to change view again. It should do it automatically. Now it shows my wife's PC over a LAN connection. So you're going to right click that and go pin to quick access. Now, whenever you restart your computer or anything like that, you'll have both of these for quick access, okay? Uh, default should show up automatically. Public would not show up. I had to go to public. I had to go to properties. I had to go to sharing. In sharing, I had to hit share. I went up here and I clicked share with everyone or guest, you know, and you might not be comfortable sharing it with everyone. Um, yeah, but you do that and you close and that should whatever f you can do that for any file that you're trying to share over a LAN connection. So anyway, yeah, you close it down, you come up here and then I can click that in the quick access and get access to Shauna's PC and click that and get access to my PC. And even if you go back here, navigation panel and click, turn that off, you can still get these through quick access so sorry guys if you were hoping that by clicking on this it would make your two computers show up here I don't know why Windows 10 did that but there's a workaround for those of you who are frustrated and are willing to s settle with anything so thanks for watching